So let's get started. In the box, we have the shimmer dock. We can use the shimmer sensor attached to the dock via the, dock, via the USB connection to stream the physiological data either through the consensus app or the shimmer capture app. So these are the GSR electrodes. Um, and these are the biophysical lead, which plugs into the shimmer sensor. And we have the optical pulse probe, which is used to get the PPG information. Uh, we can calculate things like heart rate from the PPG information. So take the leads and plug them into the shimmer sensor, like so. And the optical pulse probe is a 3.5 mm jack. The other end of the biophysical lead can attach to the GSR electrodes like so. And you can dock the shimmer to the dock. And these buttons are programmable to like say when you press a button it will start the stream or log the stream etc. Um, for the participant you could connect the optical pulse probe to the ear lobe of the participant with the logo facing outside and the electrodes like so. And on the side of the shimmer, there's a button when pulled turns on the shimmer and the LEDs indicate the connection and the streaming status. In the Windows machine, you could add a new Bluetooth device search for the shimmer the default pair code is one two three four and once connected we can uh, start the application in the application you can find the com port in my case it's 13 click connect and then it will stream uh, you can click stream and it'll stream the information you can configure things like showing heart rate in tools config and select ppg to heart rate it would take a 10 second sample of ppg to calculate the heart rate click on LSL stream as well click on stream and log and it's going to calculate the heart rate of the person along with all the other information so to show this information unity click on a sample unity LSL application I'll link the uh, github link in the video description so once inside unity you can look up the LSL streams to see the stream so this is not a modified application, this is a default LSL application. So click on play and then you could see that all the physiological data is being streamed. You can edit the parameters to the stream like so. 